102.7 KISS FM. It's time for Ryan's Roses. We have Nikki on the phone here in Glendale. Now, listen, uh, you say in your email here, Dear Ryan, the other day a friend of yours insisted she come over while your husband was at work. It's out of character for her. So she comes over, and what does she do when she comes over, Nikki? Well, it was so random that she, um, first of all, that she came over at the time, and she was she was watching an Instagram live um, at this time when my husband like appeared in the background of a grocery store, and it was like so random, and um, it was like hard to get a look. Um, but he was that the guy was wearing a black T-shirt and my husband, like he always wears black T-shirts. And um, and I don't know. It's like things have been so busy lately. And like, I didn't really think anything of it. But now, like, I just can't stop thinking about it. Hmm. I'm not hmm. following. So your husband was in the background of this Instagram live that your friend was watching. Yes. And she took a screenshot and then she came over and she was like. Is this, you know, oh. and, and I was like, I don't know. I don't think so. But then wait a second. Maybe it is him. What was he doing? What was he doing in the picture? Yeah. Well, he had his arm around like this woman and he kissed her on the head in the grocery store. And I'm like, oh, God. You know what I mean? It's so like, this, this is like so you're weird. seeing this live. You're seeing it. Is that what we're saying? Well, yeah, it, it was live. it was live, but then the friend asked she was this. She yeah. was watching. She was taking screenshots to come over with the evidence. So that action, though, from the screenshots happened in real time, right? In the background, it Got had it. already happened. But then Got she it. came over Got to it. her friend's but house. How to show sure her. are you? This is your husband. Like 70 percent. I mean, is it a grocery store that would be, is it a grocery store near you? Is it a grocery store that you think that he would be at? I mean, I just, do you know when you get that feeling in your stomach, that's what's happening. You know what I'm saying? Okay. Okay. Hold one second. Wow. Let's see. We're going to make the call. See if we can find out. Mm -hmm. Was uh, her husband in the background kissing another woman on the head in the grocery store? (laughs) Intimate. Grocery shopping's intimate. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Good to have you with us this morning. So, Nikki just revealed to us that a friend comes over to show her a screenshot on her phone of what she thinks, the friend thinks, is her husband. And in the screenshot, this was a, a live video, and in the background, her friend thinks her husband was at the grocery store holding hands, hugging, and kissing some other woman in the background. That's what she saw. I mean, the odds of all that happening at the same time and your friend capturing this moment in the background, it's like meant to be that you catch him. You know what I'm saying? Yeah. It's like meant to be that it happened. He was there. He makes the kiss. It's in the background of your friend's phone. And then you find out about it. So, Nikki, I need you to say, Ryan, you have my permission to call and then his name on Kiss FM. Go ahead. Ryan, you have my permission to call. On Kiss FM. And we are going to do that now. Be very quiet. Let us see what we can find out, all right? Thank you. All right, here we go. Hello. Hi, is this Victor? Yeah, that's me. Hi, Victor. My name is Megan. I'm calling from the Glendale Garden. How are you doing this morning? I'm I'm good. Hi, we're actually a flower shop on brand near the Americana, and we're offering local residents oh, okay. a promotion today. It's a free dozen red roses that you can send to anybody that you'd like. They're absolutely free. I'm just trying to promote my business, and if you okay, like... You're, why you're giving away free roses? Yes. Wasn't it's, Valentine's Day like a while ago? Yes, this has nothing to do with Valentine's Day. We're just trying to promote our business and our delivery service. So if you have anybody that you would like to send flowers to, they're absolutely free. I would just need the name of the person that you'd want to send them to, and we can get them out by lunchtime today. Yeah. Okay, I'll take Rose. Do I have to come get them by lunchtime, or are you going to nope. deliver them? We can deliver them. So who okay. would you like to send them to? Wait, are you um, are you trying to bust me? Bust you? Yeah, I, I feel like I've heard something like this before. You're testing me, right? This is like, is he going to send them to his wife? Yeah, send them to my wife. What's her name? You got me. What's your wife's name? 
Uh, Nikki. Send them, send them to my wife, Nikki. Victor, your voice is being broadcast on the radio. This is a test. That's what I thought. I know. I heard you. Wait, so why would we there? be testing? How could why would we Nikki, voice, why your you, voice why, is being broadcast? You me? What are you doing to me? Uh, let me say something, Victor. Why did you think it was a test? What made you think I'm being tested? <laughs> Seems guilty. I've heard of this before because this is because no one just gives free roses unless they're testing you. I don't know. Right, but do you have? Should we be testing you, Victor? Is there a reason? Mm-hmm. No. Why? Okay. No. Why All would you right, be well, testing? I'm going to bring Nikki, in your wife. Here? What are Nikki? we doing, Nikki? Why don't you tell Victor while we're on with him? Why we're testing him? Yeah. Why are we, Why are we on the radio, hon? Because we saw, I, I've seen a screenshot of you in the grocery store on the west side with another woman, and I just want to know, Who where is? are you right now? What? A grocery store? That's right. What the hell? You were seen. You were caught, bro. Yeah. We There's have a woman the you're with. You're shopping for groceries. You got caught her on the shopping head. Shopping for groceries? With another woman that you kissed on the head. Who is the woman? I have no idea. What are you talking about? I've... I don't even do most of the grocery shopping. Victor, who are you grocery shopping with? I am not buying any groceries. I don't. I can't remember the last time right, I bought here, groceries. Right, I don't who know are you meeting on the, on the west side? Here's the thing. Look. Victor. What? There's no one in the world has more patience than we. So we can continue and go in circles here. What is it, Tanya? I mean, there's a couple more people. Okay, more please. People. Yeah. We're in the middle of this. We can go in circles here. You can admit to what you did. Or Nikki can just show you the photos. She's got them. So, Nikki, I mean, to me, it sounds like that's the next step here because we're going in circles. Yeah, All right? Look, you got me. I bought broccoli one time, and I forgot to tell you. Look, obviously, <sighs> we need to talk about but this. But you kissed clearly, the head. You're with another phone woman. Call is you're trying to trick me. You're trying to catch me in some way. I'm not cheating. I'm not lying. All right. Well, we Victor, probably let, have a real conversation. Uh, not that's on what we let you do. Goodbye. Thank you, Victor. And Nikki, good luck. I think you should go show him what you have. Thank you guys very much. To me, that's like he's He's defensive. Got yeah. guilt in all of all of the sound of his voice. All right, we'll come back to that. We just had Victor and Nikki on the phone. These two married. He was caught in the grocery store in a photo shopping with another woman, kissing her on the head. He knew he was being tested. He knew it was Ryan's roses. And his voice, I mean, his voice got so falsetto defensive. And he also knew it was a test. So, like, already he's carrying some sort of, I think, guilt or or, or secret because he knew he was being tested and he got really high pitched in his voice. And then, I mean, we're just going in circles. This guy's yeah, just it's going in circles. Interesting he called this. it a test and not a scam. Well, because he, because he already in his head, he's holding a secret. You know what I mean? He's like, uh, I'm being tested, not, is this a scam? Like, I feel like that's, there's two different. I'm no expert, but when someone gets, when someone does two things, they're hiding something, goes into a real falsetto in their explanation, mm -hmm. or as a stall tactic, what are you talking about? Like I said, we talking about me? Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. Yeah, it was the broccoli line that really threw me. Sorry about broccoli. It's like no, that's not what we we're talking about. Well, everything about him was yeah. guilty to me. Everything about him was disingenuous to me. Mm -hmm. And we have patience, or Tanya thinks we don't. Well, no, I just you said we're like the most patient people, and I was like, oh. well, we really are. If you if you think about it, I don't know who's more patient than we. <laughs> you were like the most you, impatient person on the planet. In Ryan's Roses? Mm, just I in think general. in Ryan's Roses, I'm very patient. Like, of the three of us, I think you're Who's the, the most impatient. <laughs> you're the <laughs> Tell least me now. patient. Yes, you. And then maybe me. And then Tanya's probably the most patient. <laughs> Would you rather be... All right, this is fine. Forget the couple. <laughs> uh, they got uh -oh. problems. Now we're fighting. <laughs> no, I'm not fighting. I just want... I'm very curious <laughs> no, no, now. No, no, no. you're both no, set no, up. No, no, no. No, no, no. You're talking about me? What are you talking about? What are you talking about? So would you rather be impatient or patient? I'd rather be impatient. Uh, depends on the scenario. Generic. Why? Because no. if it's life-threatening, then I want to be impatient because I want to get to the... No, if it's life-threatening, I'd rather be impatient to get to a decision. That's what I'm saying. Decision. Yes, if it's life-threatening, then we need to be impatient. We need to get to the thing. But if it's... 
you know, just like not, life in general. Yeah, life in general. Then it's good to be patient, and then just kind of be go with the flow. Oh. You, drive to, the you flow. drive to your restaurant. They tell you it's a forty-five minute wait. I cut my losses and say next time. I'm impatient. I don't want to. Oh, wait. that no. I'll sit there and wait two hours. No, no. Get your meal and get done. Like move I will. On. I'll be patient for that stuff. I'll wait for food. I can't. I will. I mean, I will, but not 45 minutes. I waited two hours for that Yovo pasta place right there. there. How did, oh, oh, that gosh. place is cool, though. I, did, I waited two is hours. That they, is really? that where is they make good? all the different ones? Yeah. yeah, it's all the different ones. Yeah, 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 yeah. Uh, yeah. So it's it's like fun for the whole family. It, it was. was free? Well, we had the whole family, so we had to wait for like an extra like uh, booth area that, because we had the kids. You, it was like a whole you thing. come in with an army. I know. Well, and they actually... There was a mess up, so it wasn't supposed to be that long. It was supposed to be like an hour and some change, and then it ended up being like an hour and forty five. Well, the, it's, fine. The, it's no direct science predicting the tables. Like forty five minutes. How do you know it's forty five minutes? I know. I always think that minutes. too. I'm like, how do they know? It is they what know. it is. You know, you just like have to make the best of it. I don't like when well, it comes to right. that stuff. It's just like, what are you gonna do? I'm not gonna sit there and get mad. Go to the restaurant next door. Yeah, me too. No, a pasta different uh-uh. night. Uh-uh. I was like, once <laughs> my head is like, that's what we're eating. We'll just wait. Oh wow. I know. I'm not that person. I am. Michael's not either, I'm, and he sits I'm there and just deals with it. over whatever food I thought I was going to yeah, have. Yeah, same with me with food. <laughs> I but, do not have my heart so set on it. It's got to be like two hours from now I can have it. Patience. I don't have any. I don't. I blame my dad. He's the most impatient I've ever met. Love is and patient. I'm, I what? think my dad, my dad is Love so is patient. patient, I get the patience from him. Probably. Exactly. And mine's not, and I don't, and here we are. 